The Department of Game and Inland Fisheries uh, Operation Dry Water is now underway across Virginia. The goal is to keep people safe on the water this weekend and all the future coming weekends. 10 News reporter Coulter Anstead was with two officers today as they caught up with an unsafe boater. The two officers stopped a jet ski pulling people on a tube. Statewide, there will be over 150 DGIF officers on patrol this weekend. How you doing, sir? A fun day on the lake for a group of tubers was interrupted Friday afternoon by a visit from DGIF officer Brett Clawson and his partner. The reason why we're pulling up alongside y'all is because the capacity on this PWC is three individuals, okay. right? The amount of individuals on the PWC equal the amount of individuals that are allowed on the raft and the PWC. Okay. All right. So right now we have four out of three. Right. Yep. The uh, mindset behind that is, you know, if they were to hit something or the right. tube pop, there's only room for three individuals okay. on board. Clawson says there are several signs he looks out for that indicate someone is being unsafe. We look for mostly reckless operation type of tendencies, individuals riding on decks and gunnels, uh, riding within 50 feet of structures or other vessels. Uh, PWC splashing each other within 50 feet of each other. Anything that endangers life, limb, or property. Whether violators are issued a warning or a summons is up to the discretion of the DGIF officers. If you're bung under the influence, uh, it's a class one misdemeanor. And of course, the severity of the charges can differ depending on where you are. The group of tubers received a verbal warning. So you see how busy it is yeah. out here today. Yeah. Head on back in. Head on back in for me. Yeah. Uh, have somebody hop off and then you enjoy the rest of your day, all right? For a list of boating rules to follow to make sure your fun isn't interrupted this weekend by a visit from DGIF officers, click on the link in this story on our website, WSLS.com. At Smith Mountain Lake, Colter Anstat, 10 News, working for you.